Welcome to Sack Reviews, brought to you by Not Just Gaming. I got two special guests today, Mr. Rooster and Odds of the Lion Den. We have a special today. We have all six, one, two, three, four, five, six, I don't know if that's in the correct order, of the Star Wars Steelbooks. Yes! 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 So these are available pretty much everywhere. They're still available, actually. Yeah, there's a lot available, so don't you don't have to panic. If you're, there wasn't you, initially. Yeah. Um, I believe... They're most places seventeen ninety nine. Yes, seventeen, sixteen ninety nine. Was twelve ninety nine? Yeah, it was. Oh, we got screwed. But comes with all. We have to buy them separately. There's no. I don't think there's any like specials if you nope. buy them all together. Unfortunately, that would be a good thing. Get maybe like a movie ticket. Maybe when all nine come out. They'll so give you we'll a go right saber. in. We have the first one of good old Darth Maul. The Phantom Menace. Phantom Menace. We have the front, which is a, which. One thing I really like is that the Star Wars on the front is beveled. As a nice little, is it? Yeah. Ooh, I like that. We have Darth Maul on the back, and then we have. That's what I really like about these yeah. is that all the backs are actually the movie poster. The movie art. poster, basically yeah. Liam Neeson. And we have, I believe, Rip Liam. It's yes. Oh, there is inside a cover yeah. art. Yeah, we have Ooh. Star Wars Episode One. The disc, pretty that's basic. The scene with um, Anakin yes. getting questioned by yes. Yoda. Yes, the guy's a giant forehead. It's Peyton Manning. They're questioning yeah. whether or not they want to keep him because you know he's, um, well. Too old to basically start as Padawan training. Yeah. Okay. Which they're worried that would it could be trouble down the line and stuff. We know where that goes. That's episode one. Fox Ops are really good for now. Then we have episode two, Mr. Yoda. Attack of the Clones. Attack of the Clones. We all love Yoda. Oh, I can show that. Let me have and, the back of that. Um, just for anybody to understand, if you can't read the backs, um, all six movies don't come with any special features other than audio commentaries. One by George and the crew. And then the other one by cast. And uh, are these the original or are they the edited ones? Everything's edited. Edited, okay. And we... I have heard on a, set, a side note that they will be releasing at some point unedited versions of all six. Yet again, disc is pretty basic. Nothing really special. Let me see what scene this is. It this is, is just a oh, it's just the clone yeah. army. Oh, okay. the clone army. If, you, the if you've already purchased Whoa. the complete saga when it came out, I think two or three years ago. It's the same exact disc. It's just in a steelbook. In a steelbook They're case. all beveled, which is I, I don't know if I said that about all of them, yeah. but all of them are beveled for the side. And you have Star Wars clones. I really hope that they keep this um, format though going forward. Yeah. For I hope they don't Force Awakens. Either do like a metal so who is going though. to be the character on the Force Awakens one? Probably, Probably Ray. Ray. Really? I would go with Ray. And we're, now we have Episode Three. Revenge of the Revenge Sith. Revenge of the Sith. I'm not sure who that is. That's <laughs> General Grievous. General Grievous. Grievous. I'm not that robot. I haven't seen one, two, and three. I do own the steelbook, so I'm getting gotta get on that. And we have the back. Yep. Good old. The only thing that I'm very interested about, and I don't think on the actual Return of the You are the chosen of, one. Revenge of the Sith. I don't believe Darth Vader's on the poster. Is he not? Oh, he's he on there, on, but yes. he, I don't think he's in the. On the original poster, I don't yeah, think so. Though. And the <laughs> spine is not beveled at all either. It's just normal spine, and then it's Revenge of the Sith. Let me open this up. Inside. Yet again. And you have that iconic fight. At the the end climax of... that everyone knows. Yet again. From the prequels. Episode three. The, the, one, only, the only good thing about the entire... The one amazing is, uh, scene from the prequels, besides... Honestly, I like the Darth Maul fight, too, even though it was, no. like, full Matrix. And then yeah. if you completely open it, that's what it looks like. Not, I don't think it's not simultaneous, but it has a nice little look to it. It's not simultaneous, but it's cool. Very nice. The, the inside is the best part of this one. Yeah. I, I really it, wish they would have did some sort of design with the disc. I like, when they I like the minimal design. I like the minimal design. There we have... I mean, I kind of wish that for this they kind of gave us a couple extra features, mm -hmm. but I know... I don't know about right. yeah, yeah. So we got A New Hope. Episode 4. Four. There's the back of the slipcover. It's nothing special. Same thing as always. This is our front. Mr. Vader. We love Darth. We love Darth. And on our back is the traditional poster here. Very good stuff. Very good stuff. Here's the side. Let's take a look on the inside. Ah, uh, it's that binary sunset. Yep, we got that the disc minimalist again. disc. And then our scene on the inside here. Binary. It's a classic. It's a classic. One of John Williams' best pieces in the whole movie. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. That's episode four. I like this. I like the inside. was another takeaway yeah. on this one again. Cool. On uh, The Empire Strikes Back, we got generic Stormtrooper. You know, they, they ran out of people for this one. <laughs> it happens. Shit happens. Why? You know what? I find a very interesting point. For the, for the original trilogy, why didn't they use... Any of the heroes? Why did they use Han? Why did they use Leia? Why did they use Luke? For the original trilogy? Hmm? Maybe they'll do it three. All three of them in the next one. Arguably, arguably, well, Vader the, is a hero. For the seven seconds in which yeah. Luke Skywalker's in the movie. 
stuff. Just the I mean, arguably, Darth Vader is a hero. Technically, I mean, if yeah. by the end of things, yeah. For those of you who don't know, he fulfilled the prophecy. I don't know if I'm pretty sure at this point Star Wars is pretty beaten to death. Yeah. Follows the Skywalker family. Starts the numbered again. ones, the numbered ones will always follow the Skywalker family. No, actually, they said that all movies going forward will have some sort of mention Even to the a spin-offs? Skywalker. Yes. Well, I, I yeah, it's true. Uh, Rogue One's gonna have Darth Vader in it. Um, spin-off films that'll be interesting with Han. According to at least Kathleen Kennedy, she said it's always gonna tie back to the Skywalker. Well, she's the head of Disney right now, so. Yep. Well, she says goes, folks. All right, so generic clone trooper. Same thing on the back. Just a couple random scenes. Talks about commentary. A little brief. That's all it is. Commentary and interviews. Unfortunately, I wish they would have gave us a little. Generic little clone trooper. Then the poster. I love you. I know. Uh, and the side. I like the side. Good old and spine. This, this, this ba thingy, majiggy, whatever they call it, I like it. The bevel. Uh, the I bevel. like the embeveled look and the t feel. Almost a taste. All right, here's the inside. Uh, generic disc. Generic minimalist design again on the disc. Let's not break it. I hate, that's the only bad thing about steel look sometimes. It's hard to get the disc. It is again. And an iconic scene again. Battle of Hoth. The Battle of Hoth. What do you think? Hoth. I oh, love them. These insides animals. are really taken. The I honestly, yeah. so works. far, my favorite one is definitely uh, New Hope. I do like the design on the back here for the poster. Yeah, though. the poster one is, is cool. really, really is cool. smart design. I really like how they. I, well, I know what they did with uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles one that was actually embossed. That's, mm -hmm. I love okay. when they do that with the cover. They put more effort. He just likes to cover. feel it across yeah. his body. I like when they actually put more. Like, they did a good job <laughs> on the steel books. <laughs> I really wish the discs were a little different and a little more bonus features. But Trust me, don't be lied to. He does this all. I do. Day. I do. <laughs> well, he. I told, like I said before, Disney did a re like a recycle on these. Yeah. Yeah, but I like it. I like it. It's cool. Um, and of course, we're gonna round it off with the Emperor, our Gilf machine. Good. 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 Slip cover again. Six. Generic. Generic. Uh, so we got Emperor Fuckatine, and then on the back. The poster once again. I actually didn't know those were posters. Like when I first looked at them, they're just... they're shrunken down versions of the poster. They're, they're shrunken. You can see a little bit of pixelation. The Ewoks. Uh, and the side. Uh, yes, Ewok right there. Little Ewok. Uh, he, that's the one that helps them in the film and gets them into the village. Yeah. The again, disc. number six, and the space battle. Really yeah, nice. the space battle. It's a trap. I feel like they put more time in the cut in the inside covers than the actual. Wait, I, I, well, I think they knew that as long as they got the the front, doesn't no matter what they put yeah. on it. If, as long as it's at Star Wars and Steelbook, they're like, take my money. Oh, Pretty I, much. I like it even says Steelbook here on the inside. Yeah. Like it always does. Still um, nice. I know the only difference between these six and the complete saga is the complete saga comes with one bonus disc. Yep. And it includes some interviews. I know they were able to track down um, for an interview Liam Neeson, some other people like that. I believe it seems they have to. Yeah. And the alternate scenes where they had like Jabba as a human and stuff like that. Right. I hope he doesn't fall. It's going to fall. It's probably going to fall. There you go. All right. Well, overall, they were... PO. it's going to cost you how much is that? 36 72 It's going to cost you about $90 for all of them. Which isn't comparatively when they, I think the whole saga came out, it was about 90 95 yeah. So it's not bad. And you do get the, the nice sleek metal case, which is a selling point. Yeah. <laughs> Mostly for me. I don't know about you guys. I know. I don't, I don't I know, but them. even if you go back in the Best Buy, they don't have a lot left. So. No. It's been, have, it's been a while, though. Yeah. So it's, but even them having as we all said, we had to get him. He's a fetishist, but yes. me and him are Star Wars fans, so we had to get mm -hmm. them. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. If you look into both corners, they will have videos. Look at C-3PO. Yes. On Mr. C-3PO and on other C-3PO, we will have a couple of recent still book reviews. We have the Batman Bad Blood on the Funko C-3PO. And the last witch hunter, and on the other C3PO. Up, up here, towards up the, the light, up in the corner. This is going to lead to our play, uh, sax playlist for reviews. We'll also um, have it in the description too. If you, in the description below as well, yes, of course. If you want to check out his other reviews, mm -hmm. um, obviously it's not just steelbooks. It could be some movies, TV, games, you know. whatever. We have uh, for another steelbook review. We do have Spectre coming out next week, oh, which yep. will be a good one. And the number Deadpool ninety-nine movie. on the James Bond franchise. Yep. Yeah. And we'll have. Deadpool the movie, which I am, I am overly excited for. I cannot wait. We will be devoting some time in our podcast for that. Um, we're gonna have to. He can't contain himself. Podcasts are are on at usually eight p.m. We're Eastern gonna do on Fridays. This week, because of due to um, the screening of Deadpool, the way that the movie theaters are holding it, we had to push the time back to ten p.m. due to the fact that 
One of us can't make it to see it Thursday. I have to see it Friday. Mm -hmm. I wasn't really going to play the game. It's okay. It's, it's me. This guy. Get I go to here. school for a living, so. Um, so, to accommodate, we're going to just move a little bit later this week. But normally, it's 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every Friday. Um, follow sure. us on Twitter. Mm -hmm. On Twitch. You can check out the Facebook group. I think it's still there. It's not really there. Yeah. Oh, it's not. Uh, Instagram. <laughs> all these links will be in the description below. Also, please like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs>